Hey, 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 Hello, I'm here to introduce the big TV surprise. It's me. Oh, man, I'm changing the channel. I'm leaving town today. Huh? Yes! I'm going on a world tour of my company's many hotels. Some would call it a long vacation. I call it hard work with pool time. And while I'm gone, my company will be run by my most trusted advisor, somebody who I know will do an amazing job. My goldfish, Goldie! What? Good luck, Goldie. What? Now it's time to vacation. I mean, work hard. No! Goldie! Hey, it looks like your old friend Goldie just got a huge promotion. You go, girl. I don't know. Running a big company sounds tough. I hope Goldie's up for it. I sure wouldn't be. Hey, we need your help running this big company. But that's the thing I just said I don't want to do. You have a special bond with Goldie and nobody else understands her, so you need to be our new fish assistant. See you tomorrow! <laughs> To the world of business. Mom, I'm just here to help my friend. What is it? I can't make heads the, the world of business makes me uncomfortable. Ha! Looks like we've got an office jokester. Everybody loves business. Now I'll leave you to figure out our new leader's fishy wishes. Go, the old friend. Boy, have you come up in the world. Congratulations on the big promotion. Ah, I, I, I get it. I understand. So, what's the plan? Sell some stocks? Send some faxes? Invest in some investments? <laughs> hey, Hank. How's the working world? Really bad. Goldie doesn't care about this stuff. But the executives all want me to tell them what she wants. And, well, she doesn't want anything. What a disaster. More like, what an opportunity. <laughs> Just make stuff up. I mean, you can do whatever you want. I don't really want to start lying on my first day of work, Tom. It's not lying, Hank. It's bending the truth to make the world a better place. <laughs> Goldie has made a decision. She wants the company's new focus to be helping everyone in town and just kind of making the world a better place. It, that's the truth, OK? more of a figurehead. The real ideas come from our buddy Hank, and that idea came from our buddy me. Wait, Hank, you got all of this for yourself? That seems selfish. The truth is, something has been bothering me. I feel that I need a team to play a roller laser tag with. Anyone interested? <laughs> Snack size 
silo's running a little low. I'll tell somebody Goldie wants it refilled. Uh-oh, Goldie. Guess we goofed off longer than we thought. Everyone must have gone home. Not everyone. How are you enjoying the job that should have been mine? Oh, it's pretty tough. That Angela's a menace with a laser blaster. I know what you're doing. You're trying to make Uncle CEO's company your own personal playground. Darren, that's not true. I'm making the world a better place by doing only the things that Goldie wants. Goldie is a dumb fish. She doesn't want anything. <laughs> I, uh, oh, Goldie says you're fired. <gasps> hey, I wanted to talk her out of it, but then you were mean to me. So I think it's best that you go. Wait, no, I was kidding. Making a silly joke between two businessmen. <laughs> See, I'm laughing. I don't want to go. I love what I do here. I said go. <laughs> you ready for a rematch, Hank, or what? <coughs> not now, guys. I'm not in the mood. But we're just getting started. Not now! <coughs> okay, look, guys, we should go, okay? Let's go. Don't look at me like that. I did what I had to do, right? Give us a power smile. <laughs> I need to speak with Hank. Let he me hasn't talk been with him. Let me no, talk no, with no. him. No, 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 don't put me on hold again. <sighs> and they hung up. No. Uh... Oh, maybe we can find out what's going on with him from this press conference he's given on TV. It's time for this company to announce our next big change. I have, uh, I mean, Goldie has bought every TV channel. From now on, the only show broadcast anywhere will be my favorite show, Bongo and McGillicuddy. You're welcome. And we are paying for this by canceling all our current world-improving projects. Don't blame me, blame the fish. Hank has lost it. This is all my fault. I told him to take over the company. <laughs> it seemed like such a good idea. You gave him a lot of power, and he got a lot of corrupt. It's almost like those two things are related. Well, they're not going to be related for long. Come on, let's go get our friend back. Yeah! I want a meeting with Hank, now. Sorry, Tom, but you don't have an appointment, and we're very busy. We're getting off his haircuts. Hank, this isn't you. Turning into a bad guy. No, oh, Angela, that's ridiculous. <laughs> Remove these garage people from the building at once. So there's the fish. <laughs> oh, no. Let me handle this. Eat candy. <laughs> Hurry, to the elevator. Hank, enough is enough. You're coming home. <sighs> All right, Tom. You have made your way through all my people. I suppose you've earned a meeting. But first, could you take three steps to the right? Okay, you got steps don't have them. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> you got insane? Let us out! I can't do that, Ben. I have an appointment to join an executive golf club. I'm sorry, but that's my ride. Come on, Goldie, let's copter. What are you doing? Don't press that button! Don't you dare! Goldie, you betrayed me! It looks like Goldie finally made a real decision. And now you need to decide what's more important, your job or your friends. But Tom, you said this was an opportunity. And then I, well, I got so many nice things that... Oh, ah! This place has turned me into a monster. I don't even like golf. 
Oh, I know, Hank. Golf is awful. Okay, let's get out of here before another one of us gets a job, huh? Okay? Agreed. I think we've learned that there's only one of us who can handle the power of this position. The company is in your hands. The fins. Good luck, Goldie. Subscribing has never been easier. Press the button and you'll never miss an episode.